Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to continue with part 2 of the Leo Pay series. If you haven't watched already part 1, how to open an account and what is in general Leo Pay, I invite you to do and uh, to go and watch part 1 of Leo Pay. And before we begin, as always, don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and uh, also uh, like and share the videos because it would help me very much. So, uh, as you can see on my email here, I just received uh, the confirmation email that I got verified and my uh, account on LeoPay is now active. So, it says in here, congratulations, you have uh, been successfully verified, so we now uh, can uh, log in. Uh, basically, um, as I told you on part one of LeoPay, I got... Uh, on um, a video uh, a video call with an employee of LeoPay to make uh, the verification process uh, they will ask you a couple of questions like the name your address they will ask you to make a photo of your ID document and so on basically I got left only with uh, the proof of address uh, because in our country our ID document doesn't have the address printed uh, in there so uh, if you are in the same position then uh, uh, next LeoPay will send you an email uh, so you can send them uh, the document that I told you a utility bill or a bank statement or uh, any document official document let's say that has your address in here and the address must be the same uh, as the address you enter when you created your LeoPay account so basically I send them um, my documents uh, for the proof of address uh, they verified it and uh, all worked fine so now I'm verified and I can enter and begin to use my LeoPay account so let's click on login and log in into our new account okay here we are now we are uh, in my account my uh, new level pay account as you can see we are on the overview tab in here and uh, as you can see the status uh, the status now is uh, active obviously i have zero balance because uh, i don't have anything yet and uh, yeah we can see basically the account balance for the 10 days which we're going to use obviously lately so uh, to be short into this obviously we have the accounts in here the tab accounts uh, if we take a look okay in here you can see that i have uh, already an account in euro uh, this one is automatic uh, automatic because um, uh, since LeoPay is in Europe, then it opens uh, uh, a Euro account for you. But obviously, you can add uh, accounts in here in other currencies, which I'm going to do obviously later because I want to open another one in US dollars since I use my crypto exchanges in US dollars. And also, I want to order uh, my uh, Visa debit cards, so one in Euro and one in US dollars. So I, uh, I will be able to have both currencies and these are both currencies that we use uh, in our country these are uh, are the most used let's say uh, so uh, and since i'm in europe although i'm not in the european europe uh, obviously i will choose uh, euro and uh, us dollars because us dollars is it's more international let's say for um, uh, for making uh, online payments or um, any other thing uh, related to uh, to the online uh, payments and uh, buying and trading uh, so uh, uh, yeah and uh, as I, I told you on the first part uh, of Leo pay uh, my uh, reason of opening this account is to uh, to have a SEPA account because with the Leo pay account you are able to open and use and benefit from the SEPA agreement so uh, yeah I although I am in a country which we don't use SEPA agreement now I have an account uh, which I can use with the SEPA agreement and I can use this uh, I can have different accounts IBAN accounts SWIFT accounts SEPA accounts uh, all of them I can have um, uh, with LeoPay also i can close them whatever you want and all the opening of new accounts and closing the existing accounts are all free of charge so you can open and close accounts whatever you want if you 
uh, if you don't use them uh, I mean by closing so uh, obviously um, if you have used uh, an online banking account like your local bank if you have an online access to your bank account is basically the same thing we can see our transaction we can make transfer with our leo pay account from a leo pay account to another leo pay account if we have friends that use this one obviously we can use uh, transfer from leo pay account to our bank account our local bank account that we have already uh, whatever uh, it is uh, also we can make top ups if we take a look in here uh, you go in here, you choose your country. Obviously, I am in Albania, so I'll choose Albania. And with my LeoPay account, I can recharge my phone if I have a Vodafone number. So uh, maybe in your country, you can use uh, more things. Let's try, for example, Germany. Let's see. Uh, yeah, as you can see in here, prepaid code, gift cards. You can top up LeoPay, top up. Uh, you have mobiles. Oh my God, you have so many which you can top up. Uh, wow prepaid code mobile recharge nice uh, okay prepaid code games prepaid code music nice so um, as you can see it depends on the country you live let's take a look at italy in here oh <laughs> yes so yeah people in italy i invite you to register to leo pay so yeah you can do um, a lot of things with, with your leo pay accounts uh, obviously maybe you can do all of this with your current bank account obviously uh, but um, as I told you on the first part uh, Leope is uh, uh, basically for the people that don't live in the European Union so they can benefit from uh, from having an account in the European Union although they are not there so uh, we can benefit from it uh, obviously then uh, in the funding section obviously you can fund your LeoPay account which I will do uh, uh, mostly I will fund my LeoPay account from crypto selling when I will sell my crypto I will transfer uh, my money from uh, the crypto exchange that I will sell to my LeoPay account with the SEPA agreement. We will try that. I don't know if it will work, but since it said it, uh, I think that it will work. Uh, it will work. Sorry, but um, um, anyway, we will try it uh, very, very soon if it will work, and I will share it with you. And the main thing which I am here obviously are the uh, the Visa debit card which I want to use. And now since my uh, account is uh, it's uh, active, now I can order the cards as you as you can see in here. So let's click in here and uh, as you can see, uh, please select currency of the LeoPay card and choose or create account to which you would like to link the card. So you see only one in here. Uh, because uh, because I have only one active account in euro as you saw uh, as you saw at the beginning and now I want to I am going to create another account in US dollar so I can order two free visa debit cards and one uh, card I will link it with the euro account and the other card I will link it to the USD uh, to the USD account. So let's go ahead and open the, the USD account in here because I have only the euro one. So we just click on add account obviously. Now we choose the currency. Oh, oh by the way, uh, these are the currency that are supported in the LeoPay. So we can choose euro, USD, uh, British, uh, British pound, uh, BGN, I don't know, uh, CHF, I think it's um, uh, Switzerland francs uh, this is uh, the Japan yen I don't know what it, how it's called Ron I don't know what is the, this is HRK CZK and PLN so yeah you guys that use these currencies tell us what these are I don't know all of them anyway this other currency you can uh, choose okay let's go ahead I will choose obviously US dollars uh, okay I have read um, advanced settings should we use this one uh, okay let's leave it like this we don't need it I think we can change the the settings later okay and that's it how you open uh, this is how you open a new IBAN account this is a full new account in US dollars which I can use like a normal uh, bank account you have your IBAN number you have 
obviously all the access to make transfer and make deposits in this account and obviously now uh, we will link uh, a visa debit card to this account too so yeah that's it uh, status it's active obviously and if we want we can close them right away and all is free of charge okay let's go ahead and order the cards now order card okay so uh, mm, okay uh, it shows again only one hmm okay let's uh, quantity one. Oh, okay add card nice so uh, visa mobile number personalize okay um, embassy name was this please fill in your name oh, obviously a uh, currency in euro uh, account euro account okay nice so now let's choose one with usd okay this is my account quantity one obviously add card okay now uh, visa the number is the same the name is the same and the currency is uh, us dollar as you can see in here okay so now we have one in euro and one in us dollars as i told you you can choose two free cards in here i don't know if you can add another one but maybe it's uh it's with uh, with the payment i don't know so uh let's go to the second step shall we okay second step delivery obviously we need to enter our address where the cards should be sent okay postal service country obviously zip code address uh, okay uh, i think the address must be the same but um, i'm thinking that maybe you can send them in another address but uh, i don't uh, <laughs> Uh, I think it's better to use the same address on all these things. So uh, let me put in my address and um, uh, we can go to the review and order. I think this is the last step then. Delivery through postal service is free of charge. Okay, uh, it says here that the delivery through postal service is free of charge. Okay, and the delivery is also free to the address. If the delivery is returned for a reason, uh, that Leo PLTD or the delivery company are not responsible for, you will be charged with the cost for a second delivery with regular post. Oh, okay, five euros. So um, this means that uh, if for some reason your cards doesn't come uh, uh, to your uh, address and they got back to Leo Pay, then they will charge you five dollars to be uh, to resend them again to you. So uh, I think it's not a big deal for five dollar, uh, five euros. Sorry. So uh, yeah, let's go ahead and do this. Oh, sorry, I didn't see it. So in here you have postal service, which says it's free of charge, uh, and the thing that if it gets back, then if we click to delivery via courier. Uh, maybe this is a faster one to do, but additional charges apply for delivery via courier. If the delivery is returned, okay, basically the same thing. Delivery courier delivers are executed during working hours. If you are not able to receive the delivery, uh, please choose postal services uh, as a delivery method. So, uh, yeah, if you don't mind paying and maybe have uh, the cards uh, faster, because I think that uh, delivery with the uh, VR courier uh, can be faster than postal services. I don't know. So uh, uh, if you know for sure that uh, delivery with the uh, courier is faster, then you can use this one and pay for this service, let's say. But uh, I'm, I'm going to choose postal services and see what happens. OK, now I have entered my address in here it says delivery free of charge and delivery time up to 30 days. Uh, hmm. It's a lot of time for my country. I really hope that for your country it's a little bit less. But um, um, I have a friend of mine that has uh, already uh, already ordered these cards and he, and he told me that he got his cards within 15 days so since it says up to I hope I will get them uh, in two weeks let's say because um, I need to make a transfer also so I need them as soon as possible so let's go ahead and click review order okay the two cards we have ordered 
one in euro and one in US dollars. Okay, postal services, the address, um, payments details from Leo Pay account. Also, we have zero because they are free of charge. Order detail cards, we have two pieces. Okay, nothing to pay. I have read and understood the grid legal of obviously like always so uh, yeah let's go ahead and order these two cards nice uh, your order was successful okay that was uh, it um, for today I um, I got verified in basically three days or maybe less uh, but um, it has passed so much time because I was late on getting the documents for the proof of address to LeoPay so if we calculate the one day that um, I uh, took to find my documents then one day to deliver them the documents and for them to verify and then uh, basically the next day they they got me verified so um, uh, if we add uh, them to the uh, one day that um, uh, it took me to to open the account then um, yeah basically two to three days just to open and uh, get an active account on LeoPay and uh, obviously order the the Visa debit card which you uh, want to use obviously and so far so good uh, in my opinion all went smooth I just hope I don't get in trouble with LeoPay, especially if uh, after I send the money there. But uh, since now I'm uh, till now, sorry, I'm very very happy with this service, and I hope it stays like this. Uh, yeah, that's it for today. Obviously, I will do other Peter, uh, I'll other videos. Sorry. I got a little bit excited. I will do other videos uh, showing you guys how you can use the LeoPay account. Obviously, how we can do transfer to the LeoPay, then from LeoPay, maybe other transfers. I don't know. But uh, yeah, stay tuned for this. And uh, as always, before uh, we leave, uh, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Make sure to smash the likes and also share the video. It would help me very, very much. And yeah, see you guys on the next one. Bye-bye.